We are in Victoria Centre, the heart of Nottingham City. We are here to meet a young MA fighter called Trey B, who is 17 years old. After meeting him, we headed to the Victoria Centre Market. Have a guess. After walking for a few minutes, we arrived at the Hair and Beauty Products Cosmetics and Accessories to get some protein shake. Shopping around, we left Victoria Centre. We are heading towards the gym where it all started. What inspired you to start this kind of Um Well, I used to watch it on TV a lot so like, I got really interested in it when I seen it, I was like, oh that'd be a good good thing for me to be, you know, like a hobby. I didn't really have a hobby, you know, I played basketball and football and all that, but it wasn't like pushing as much as ever made us. We should just get into fights, really. That sounds weird, but yeah, that's the point of sports. So, I, the fact that I'm even fighting is a bit cheating for me personally because, you know, I thought I would be the type of guy to go into a bit cheating for me personally because, you know, I'm I thought I would be the type of guy to go into that like, When I was younger, I always got into fights in school and like, I always used to have trouble and whenever I had to defend myself properly I always used to do the old scrapping and all that nonsense but so I thought to myself, I said you know I need more technique, I need more training I need to be good in it, I want to be able to knock someone out with one punch right? So I was looking for a gym um, one day after school I found gym combat and then you know, just going from there, gym combat, just doing gym combat for a while now. Yeah. So the fact that I'm in MMA is just a good achievement for me personally. It's hard, it's real hard. It's good, I love it. What kind of struggles do you face this kind of sport? Training? Um, struggles? Um, well, yeah, basically, training is like one of the main, main things that you face, like if you get injured. And then, like, that's the one thing you like, get injured a lot. Face as well, like, and with this sport, it takes up a lot of time. Like, you have to put a lot of money, time, and effort into it. And by doing that, you've got to, like, sacrifice a lot. And then that comes into, like, going out, eating junk food, and all that shit. So then you've got to just cut it out and just literally put your head out in the game and just go hard. In this sport, who's the more money? I think really like looks like role models really. But as fighters, I've got a lot of like favourites and guys I look up to. You know, various guys like um Anderson Silva, um Dominic Cruz, Alistair Ogreen, you know, all the big guys look up to them, you know. I want a guy from this team just come back, oh from a booth. Yeah, you will I look up to him a lot, yeah. Like good role models, I see the way he trains. 
is like one of the fights. So 